to speak. So, Shabha Mohammed, today Zafar Islam has reason to say that the Prime Minister at least first day first show with this vaccine 2.0 policy has achieved the target 75 lakhs and counting. It is over 80 lakhs, sorry, 80 lakhs and counting. We haven't even reached midnight as yet. If these numbers are sustained, the government of India could well claim that they are right. They will vaccinate every Indian by the end of the year. And the Congress was simply whinging about not having enough doses. How do you respond? Uh, Rajdeep, I, I would like some uninterrupted time because of a couple of points. First and foremost, um, very good news today that so many Indians have been vaccinated. Makes everybody, all of us, a lot, uh, across party lines happy about it. But like you mentioned, can we sustain this? Now, let me give you some facts. In January, we were told that uh, 300 uh, million people will be vaccinated in the coming few months. And if you look what happened is, and that means 600 million doses. But if you look at data, it was only 200 million. Then what happened in April? On April 2nd, around, uh, we had 42 lakh doses were given on April 2nd. But rest of the month, we saw it come down to 30 lakh per day and an average of 80 lakh per day in May. So, yes, we had a high over there. And those two months, now he was praising Mr. Modi a lot. Those two months when we were having this oxygen shortage, we were many people, uh, numbers were above 4 lakh. When people were dying, we saw them on the ganges, on the banks, uh, river banks. Where was Mr. Modi? He was like an ostrich with his head under the sand. Suddenly, when the cases went down to less than one lakh, he arises on June 7th and says, you know what? We are giving free vaccinations to all Indians. Now, even during this tough time, when uh, in May, he's the one who declared that, you know what? States are going to vaccinate 18 to 44. When we were going through hell, you know, a real leader, what is a real leader? A real leader is somebody who stands with his people people in despair when they're, they're going through tough times. This spineless Prime Minister of ours was nowhere to be seen. So no, no, beyond the rhetoric, rosy, beyond the rhetoric Shama Mohammed, beyond the rhetoric, the Congress yeah, is... I'm just giving no, you no, no, figure. one minute, ma'am. No, 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 ma'am. Uh, the Congress has kept claiming that we will never achieve this target of... Uh, of no, no, one minute of uh, vaccinating every Indian by the end of the year. At the moment, if this momentum is sustained, we'll be very close to it. So I'm just going to tell you that. So if if that momentum has to be sustained, we need 130 crore vaccines, 75 from Covishield. This is what the government has given. 55 from Covaxin. This is their report. 15.6 crores they're going to get from Sputnik. 71 crores from eBiologic, Zydus, Cadela, Novavax, and two others. Now this eBiologic, e, even the regulators have not approved it. They have said, you know, we don't know. Their, their tests are still going on. So we don't know why it has been approved and we have spent 1,500 crores to get it. Now, if you look at that, Per month, you need 25 crore of uh, of of uh, of uh, COVID shield and 22 crore of Covaxin. Now, you yourself heard that. 7.5 crores can only be made by Covaxin, your, your own reporter said, and 10 crores by Serum Institute. So that counts to 50 crores in six months of Covishield and 37.5 crores of Covaxin in six months. But we need 75 and 55 respectively. So where are the numbers coming? See, this is what happens, Rajdeep. They can say whatever, but when so we you're look saying, at it, you're the saying numbers the numbers don't, don't add up. Add up. That's the okay. numbers don't add up. And where are they? they he just now said that we are going to get uh, Pfizer. Pfizer was supposed to be given an emergency one in December, but they hit the wall and they went back angry. But we gave an emergency approval to Sputnik in April and we got the vaccines in May. So look at the hypocritical government. Pfizer, one of the best in the world, was not given an emergency approval. Now they're going and begging Pfizer. And the other very okay. important point, he says, you know, PM Modi cannot plan. Uh, he planned everything. We have 130 crore, our population. We know we will need around 200 crore of vaccines if we don't but take two doses of vaccines, yes. if we don't take the children. So all the other countries, Mr. Zafar Islam, gave money for research to their own uh, some of them had their own some of them had it abroad like canada did not produce anything but they gave money for research to other institutes which were producing these vaccines what was mr modi doing sleeping basically going busy with his his elections winning states that's what what he did when did he order the first vaccine 1.6 crore doses in january have today, have just a minute yeah. no, shama mohammed you made your point now shama mohammed this is not an it you made your point Zafar, I will let you quickly respond because there are two I other guests waiting. Miss Mohammed, your time is up. Mr. Zafar Islam, go ahead. What is this? Why is this the biggest vaccination drive? Your time is, is up, ma'am. Your is time is gift? up. Is it a gift? It's our right. It's our right. Please switch off. Uh, uh, this is not a program where you shout, ma'am. 
go ahead zafar islam she doesn't know how to how to debate she is clueless i think uh, congress should realize that she should they should send some sensible person on your no, debate no, let, let's not be personal no no but but what kind of nonsense she is doing here i asked what is the job she what is what to, is the, uh, only to only to Zafar Islam, what do you want to intervene? Give me a factual response. I, I what she says I about the prime minister is her look. She has learned only from Rahul Gandhi. So every morning she only sends the tweet, and that's what their responsibility feels. They feel as an Indian, as a as a uh, as a leader of the political party. What are what are they doing? Doing nothing for the society except sending a tweet every morning. Okay. Let me let, let me come back to you, Rajiv. She doesn't know anything. I'm waiting patiently for 22 minutes. minutes. Uh, so now let me tell you the august I, as i said 30.32 and i will tell you which are the vaccine covid shield 11.5 covaxin 6 sputnik uh, uh, 1.6 zydus cadila and all the other vaccine it will be like uh, in august we will have 32.3 to 30.53 then in september it is 46.4 to 51.5 51.4 october 45.8 to 50.8 Number fifty three point five to forty fifty eight point five. This range. At, uh, Sir, this is your min, estimation. Min, this is your estimation. No, We don't know whether the production the will match, but you've made no, your point. You've given us the no, figures. No, I have this. Okay, this yeah. is sir. The, the, sir, the health ministry over the over the last few months has thrown various numbers at us. Not in every month does it match. At the moment, this is these are the numbers as you say, which will enable us, you believe, to vaccinate.